Hello, I'm Justin Fraction for Technology Advice. What good is tracking and measuring KPIs when you can't make sense of that data for big picture business goals? Also, another thing that I can't make sense of, how can a British TV series be on for like five years but only have 14 episodes? Like, what kind of breaks are you sending people on? I digress. HR uses workforce analytics to ensure that companies' people management practices align with overarching business goals. Workforce analytics helps your HR team decide how to best do things like pay employees competitively, boost employee retention, increase employee productivity, drive down workforce costs, prepare for future workforce staffing and skills needs. Here are some tips and best practices for HR to get the most out of their workforce analytics tools. One, set HR goals that support broader business goals. For example, the HR team might set hiring and or training goals to support a new business initiative. Number two, ask strategic questions to narrow down specific metrics to track. These include questions about the short-term and long-term workforce needs. What roles will the company need in five years? Do the skill sets of our current staff meet those needs? Number three, select metrics and tools to track them. Gathering this data will set your HR team well on its way to progressing towards its goals. Number four, workforce analytics tools provide dashboards for at-a-glance visualization of all the metrics you're tracking in one place. Number five, develop and act on strategies based on the data story that the workforce analytics tools tells you. And number six, finally use workforce analytics tools to measure performance and progress towards those goals you set at the beginning. And there you have it. Workforce analytics aids HR decisions, but don't worry. It doesn't replace human decision making. Instead, Workforce Analytics supercharges the HR department with the data that makes sense, so they can make people-related decisions that support broader business goals and objectives. If you'd like to read more about HR, then feel free to visit our website at the link I'm going to put right here. Or if you'd like to see more videos we made just for you, click this playlist here. Finally, if you'd like to subscribe, click this button right here. And we'll see you next time.